Rasan Al Najjar spent her last days as a volunteer paramedic, but witnesses say she was gunned down by Israeli forces while running to treat a wounded Palestinian protester. Miles away at the UN in New York, a resolution to condemn Israeli violence was shot down by the US. It says Israel's use of force is justified and targets members of Hamas, the group that controls the Gaza Strip. Kuwait's resolution makes no mention of Hamas, none at all. Instead, the resolution places all the blame on Israel. The U.S. offered its own resolution denouncing a Hamas attack on Israel this week, but received no support, even from allies. We condemn Hamas, but at the same time, we regret that the American text does not adequately reference Israel's responsibilities and obligations with regard to Gaza. The Palestinians protesting at the Gaza-Israel border want an end to Israel's blockade of Gaza and its occupation of the West Bank. The violence that killed a Palestinian medic there followed what some say was the worst exchange of fire between Israel and Hamas since the 2014 war in Gaza. And there are concerns Israelis and Palestinians could be on the brink of a new war. Regan Devines, TRT World.